Okay, so welcome back. We're gonna do, I guess, the mission now. Apparently, last time it was just an exploration mi exploration episode, basically last episode. So this one should be a house where we bow, which I don't even think we've done anything. Level one. Formerly a promising professor, you are now the newest professor at the prestigious officers' academy. Students and faculty alike look on you in curiosity as you engage. Let's do this. I saved before this, so we should be ready. And now I'm saving again. Mine counts, Chapter 1 The Three Houses. It's finally time for the mock battle. This is my chance to measure your worth as an instructor. Do you think you can rise to the challenge? Leave it to me. So confident. This will be interesting. Each of us has undergone strict training. We're prepared for anything that comes our way. That means there's no need to hold back. Show us what you're capable of. Hey there. Did we miss our invite to this strategy meeting? No, oh, no worries. We'll just join in now. Simply tell me your weaknesses and you're welcome to stay. But is there enough time to cover them all? Ah, so you can't win unless you know my weakness. Poor princess. You really should believe in yourself more. I spare no effort when pursuing victory. As a master of schemes, I should think you would understand. Schemes? Me? I have no idea what you're talking about. I plan to fight fair and square as ever. Hearing the words fair and square from Claude can only be a bad omen. Your Highnesses haven't known me for very long, but you already have me figured out, don't you? No need to poke fun. I will fight with honor. That said, I will fight to win. Yes, and the same is true of us. Right, Professor? Never fight to lose. I don't intend to lose. If that is how you feel, then I will not hold back. Oh, how precious. Looks like you and the students have become fast friends. While I am pleased that you are taking the initiative to acquaint yourself with the students, I'm afraid it's about time for the faculty strategy meeting. What? Ah, how time flies. In that case, I'll see you later. Edelgard? Professor? Be careful out there. I don't think I'll be recording this like regularly because it takes a while. Magic. And she can provide new means of attack, defense, or unit. Attack magic in place of a weapon, okay. It replenishes at the end of a battle compared to equipment. What's the difference between black or dark magic? Develop fate to learn white magic. Not be excluded. Okay, let's do this. Let's save here. What am I fa facing first? Oh, the blue lions. And the. Uh, so it's like all. Okay, so it's all of us. We can only have five. I probably need. I want at least someone with long range. I already have a sword. We can use you next time. We have a magic, we have an axe, we have a lance. So we're pretty. sorted out. Let's go. Let's do this. Route the enemy. The mock battle is finally here. Will you lead us to victory? I'm sure you already understand, but the house that defeats the other two is declared the winner. Incidentally, I'll be overseeing this mock battle, so listen well if you want to win. Thanks, Dad. Nice. <laughs> I'm in the... Stay focused. Casual. I wanna focus on this one person first. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. 
Yeah, I could just listen to this music. None of your shallow tactics are required, Claude. Ignatz and I will dismantle the opposition. Huh. Me? But I'm not ready. <sighs> are you making light of our new professor? If you drop your guard, you're gonna get hurt. Ash, can you move to the front lines? I want to lure the enemy this way. Got it, your highness. Leave it to me. Once you finish preparing, make your move. Did you, Mercedes? Keep our enemy occupied until then. I'm on it. Oh my. We'll try our best. Oh, class master. I was wondering what changed. Nice. I wish there was a way to know if they're weak or something. I've lost. Oh, unthinkable! You fought well. They're pretty weak. I need to know what the stats does. Ah, so strong. Have to do better next time. Anywhere I can hide. At the forest. Wow, 88. Well done, Teach. I may have to take this seriously after all. What is that skill? I think it's better to take care of one of them, so we could take care of this side first. Still unstoppable. Barely survive. I've lost. The new professor is quite a commander. I don't think it. Yeah, they can't even move. We ha we'll have to go all the way around. Let's use the forest to set up an ambush. I'm counting on your support, everyone. You only have one person left. If they're waiting in the forest, we do well to take a detour. A detour. So I guess we do take care of them. I need to know what's like strong and weak to each other. Fight two houses at once? <laughs> An impressive display of confidence. This is a good opportunity for us. Let's forge ahead. Wow. Okay, so acts are strong against dancers.
apologies, your highness. I can go no further. That is that. Nice. Oh no. This is as far as I can go. Sorry about that Mercedes. Mercedes. Can I go now? Close. Are apparently strong against you. Dimitri, it's time. We can finally settle the question of who's stronger. Very well. I accept your challenge. With you as my opponent, I won't hold anything back. I would expect no less. Too, you know. My training was insufficient. I am so sorry, everyone. The rest is up to you. Not worth the risk. Not sure what to do about the uh, guy professor. Okay, they're out of the forest. It's gonna take a lot. Ferdinand von Eich. Greatness awaits me. Oh, I hate losing. I guess I'll just have to settle for cheering the others on. Interesting. Oh wait, I could change weapons? Nice. Ouch! Was that really necessary? Eh, it's a spar. As expected. We must all do our part. I hope the Bonera is uncro- Oh wait. She healed. Oh 
Aww. No matter what. I don't think he has any more. Yeah, he has no more. I can fight through anything. Hundred percent. Well done. I nearly wound up a patient in my own infirmary. Only a fool challenges me. So, you've made it past Manuela, eh? I see now I must focus and then make my move. You're the only one left. You'll be there for support. Heal time. Battle experience is well, I was as good as useless. That is that. Intermediate right, too. That's that. The winner of this mock battle is the Black Eagle House. Even though it was just a mock battle, we defeated both houses masterfully. Take pride in this victory, everyone. Huh, <sighs> ten turns. Nice. Motivation. Talking. Excellent work today, Professor. Though our victory should come as no surprise. It was easy. Yeah, sure. Yes, it was. Further proof that you're well qualified to guide the Black Eagles. Well. That was impressing, Professor. I mean, uh, impressive. We gained a victory because of your great leadership. We certainly did. We all tried our best, of course, but we couldn't have won without you. I was curious what it would look like if you did not hold back, and you did not disappoint. <laughs> I dare say we owe our victory to Lady Edelgard. How so? For that battle, she was only a soldier following our Professor's command. Sure, she was an incredibly powerful soldier. Don't worry about it too much, Linhart. All that matters is that we won. I'm all done with being on the battlefield, okay? I'd rather stay back than pursue victory out there. You were all as ridiculous as always. We only managed to win because we worked together. Was it something I said? Is it so odd, me talking about togetherness? If so, that perception must change. In fact, I'm cancelling the festivities so we can discuss this topic further. I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> Come on, everyone. We've earned this celebration. Guess she's just too serious about things. Your work with the students was remarkable. I can see Geralt trained you well. I do hope you were able to use the occasion to bond with the students. I did. I'm so happy to hear it. Nothing would please me more than if you used this coming year to grow closer still. Of course, the mock battle was mere practice. The real fight is the battle of the eagle and lion, which will take place during the wyvern moon. You are expected to properly train your students so as not to humiliate the academy during the long-held tradition that is the coming battle. Wyvern moon. As for today, I have called you here to tell you of your mission for the month ahead. Your class is to dispose of some bandits causing trouble nearby. Okay, bandits. Those affiliated with Garrig Mach Monastery have a moral obligation to help those in need, regardless of social standing. Students are no exception. Each month before the newly birthed moon departs, each house of students must complete their assigned mission. You shall work to complete the task at hand alongside your students and report back to the Archbishop before the deadline. Understood. I will soon provide you with the necessary details for your first mission. If I told you now, I expect you would only forget, and I despise repeating myself. True. 
I can sense something special within your heart. I have high hopes for you. Bandits, they say. Do you recall when we first met? You shall not fall so shamelessly again, correct? Have you no words for me? Do not tell me that you are shocked to hear from me! <laughs> you ought to know that I am always with you now. To hear my voice should not come as a shock. Right. What is this nonsense? <laughs> All I was told was to kill as many noble pipsqueaks as possible. No one said anything about the Knights of Damned Saros being on our trail. You have proven yourself worthless, distracted by something so trivial. Add some voice. I had hoped you would achieve your goal despite the setback. But now a child of the Knight's former captain is in play. How interesting. Hey, this isn't what I agreed to! You're dead. Hiring a mercenary as a professor. What was that woman thinking? Are you listening to me? How do we finish this? You die. Yeah, you're dead. What? Underestimating the knights was an amateur mistake. One you will pay for. The road to eternal torment awaits you all. Now I must locate your replacements. Wait! Get back here! Damn you! There was something about combat forecast? I know drops. So what's this? Part 1. White clouds. Harp string moon. Familiar scenery. I'm guessing the wyvern is one or two In months. Honor of the saints whose births or deaths took place under this moon. The people perform music once beloved by those divine beings. Whether by harp, by flute, or voice alone, joyous melodies are shared between farmers as they sow their seeds across the vast plains of Teltine and Grander. Okay, so they're explaining why it's called those things. In casual is on the end. In classic, they are lost forever. Yeah, we're in classic, I think. Maybe I should have gone for the casual. We'll see. New places to explore. Thank you. As you have already been notified, your mission is to subdue some bandits. Our students have been learning about combat through study. But this is a precious opportunity to provide them with practical experience. The Knights will support your mission, and are prepared to offer their assistance if necessary. In short, this is no mock battle. You must be prepared for anything. You will receive a message from the Knights when it is time to depart. Until then, use your time wisely. Okay. The last time we fought bandits, you saved me. Maybe I can return the favor this time. Let's do our best. The Knights are well aware of our enemy's strength. We can count on them to keep the battlefield under control for us. It seems unlikely that we would lose. Still, let's do all we can to prepare. You seem well. Are you adjusting to life at the monastery? I think so. Oh, I didn't expect that answer. When we were mercenaries, I handled everything. Outside of battle, you didn't have much contact with people, did you? I thought being thrown into a swarm of noble brats to teach would be a bit much for you. But I guess I had nothing to worry about. By the way, I heard about those bandits. Your first assignment is to take them out, right? That's fairly routine for you by now, but don't forget it's the first real taste of battle for those brats. It'll be tougher to sleep at night if you let one of your little pupils die. So stay vigilant and lead them well. Yeah. I wish I could offer you my support, but Lady Rhea won't allow it. For now, I'll try to figure out what she wants from you. I don't mind you settling into your life here, but don't let your guard down. Ever. 
I mean, we are in the classic mode. We got birthdays. Okay, Sundays. What? And it's sure. Thank you. Share a meal. Lots of large fish, bonding bites. Saint Maquite, Mercedes, and then make demands. Okay, so it's at the end of the day. Month. Let's just go explore. That's all we can do. I got two. Professor, hey, do you know how old Captain Gerald is? That's enough, Leone. If I don't know, how could my child know? <laughs> it's not normal to forget your own age, you know. It's kind of worrisome, actually. By the time you're forgetting your own age, you're past the point of caring. I guess if you put it that way, you've got a point. I have a request. Search for the tactics primary in the captain's quarters. That said, your performance in the mock battle was exceptional, Professor. <laughs> You have inspired me to follow your example and study even more diligently. Perhaps we could train together sometime. I would love to test myself against your sword skills again. I hear you've been tasked with hunting down bandits, right? Meanwhile, my class is stuck with a downright peaceful mission. Sounds like you'll be fighting alongside the knights, too. Don't let the monastery down, Teach. It is better if you do not approach me. If you spend too much time around a man of Dusker, there will be rumors. What? Why? Sauna? I don't know how to get there. I guess around here? That reminds me. Raphael's here. Lawrence and what? Ingrid. Oh, Felix. And now that you're all the way over here, Professor, care to join me in some training? After training, I love tending to the horses or burying myself in a good pile of books. <sighs> There's truly nothing better. Recruit? Hi, Professor. I've actually got plans, so let's talk some other time. Dex and flying, so I can recruit this. I can recruit Ingrid. For years, the Boar Prince and I were inseparable. I know him better than almost anyone else. Who's the Boar Prince? So let me give you some advice. Beneath all that princely polish, he's an animal, nothing more. He's strong and skilled, sure. But don't place your trust in him as a human being. Take care he doesn't chew you up and spit you out. I have no idea who you are talking about. Join me for some training sometime. I might like to become your student someday, but not today. Speed and sword. What do you? What does she want? Dexterity and flying? And now that you're all the way after training. Hey there, professor. You here to? Oh, that reminds me. I found this small cloth. It's kind of weird. Not really sure what it is, but it works great for wiping up sweat. It's a handkerchief, then. The next assignment is to drive out bandits? Sounds like some training is in order. Tell me something, Professor. When it comes to a one-on-one -on -one battle, which is better, strength or skill? You might be right, but when it's all said and done, I still think muscle comes out on top. True. Good to see you, Professor. I was just on my way to train, so... Strength and heavy armor. Okay. Wait. Here's an idea. Here's an idea. My sword broke. Yeah. 
come see me for advice. This one only. What? Oh, so I was right. There were some flying things. It's an owl. It's an owl, like Harry Potter. Okay, so we, we should try to do this. Set that. For some students, this will be their first time stepping onto a real battlefield. It's important that they're mentally prepared. As for me, <laughs> do I look green to you? Is there anything else you wish to ask me about regarding spending your time at the monastery or battles? Faculty training. Just as students have much to learn from other students, professors can also share their knowledge with each other. You should consider seeking instruction from Professor Hanneman or Professor Manuela. I think you'll find their insight quite interesting. Okay. Become advanced shoes. Which house a student is assigned to depends on where they're from. That said, each professor has their own area of expertise. So if a student is adamant about it, it is possible to switch someone from one house to another. Pending your approval, of course. If you become closer with the students by partaking in the various activities around the monastery, you'll be able to talk to them about such things. Non-students. I fully accept the necessity of real battle from time to time. But it is still a surprise to be tasked with punishing bandits without warning. It is a rather different sort of mission. It makes me wonder what the Archbishop is planning. It's thanks to my adoptive father, Lenato, that a commoner like me is here at the Academy. He is the very model of chivalry. Someday, I'm going to be just like him. Huh? You're- I'm really flattered, honestly. But I still have a- Cha, Lance. I have to remember a lot of these things. And I don't think I will be able to. Maybe I need to check on the- Do something for me. The library, okay. I've got to find out everyone's likes and dislikes so I know what to cook. Who knows when it'll be my turn at kitchen duty? How about you, Professor? Do you like sweet or spicy food? I like both, so we'll go spicy. Oh, spicy? Ooh, your tastes are so mature. I'll definitely remember that. Huh? You think I would be a good fit for your class? Mm, I'm not sure. There's still a lot I want to learn from my current class. Sorry to disappoint. Mad and fate. I think my problem when like doing these things is like I like to be all around, but I know there's when you do all around, you don't become a master of one thing. And I definitely learned that from <laughs> fate because of like you know under the blade works and stuff, jack of all treats, but master of none. Bridget has much more warmth than Fodlin. Even Spring here has coolness. And you, Professor? Which do you find is worst? Too hot or too cold weather? Too hot. I have a grievance. In Bridget, I am able to be wearing much lighter clothes. <laughs> I chose the wrong option, but I still got it correct. So I'll take that, I guess. Perhaps there are way too many vegetables in today's meal. The ratio of vegetables to sweets was completely skewed. Oh, hi, Professor. Were you just eavesdropping on me? Well, everyone knows a plateful of sweets is far preferred to a plateful of vegetables, regardless of age. True. Yes, I'm actually very busy right now. Match fate. A Louise. Entrance hall. Who was that? Who was that?
Where are you? Where's... What's that? This guy? <laughs> oh, Professor! How are you today? I'm just heading out for a mission. I'll be seeing you. Be careful. What makes you say that? Do you know something I don't? Are there supernatural elements at play? Ghosts? Ah! Oh, forget it. I'll be going now. Oh. Who's here? A moment, what? Please. Oh, Hilda. I'm bored. Maybe I should go into town. But that would be such a hassle. Oh, hi, Professor. I'm rather busy right now, so do make it quick. You don't look busy to me. You're busy, never mind. Are you sure? I thought you'd found me out for a moment there. Manuela. You know, Professor, what the heck is that? There are some things I'll just never understand. Like the other night. I went on a date with a dashing, handsome, strong young knight. Oh, I'm a bit weak just remembering him. Anyway, do you know what that no-good jerk said when we got back to my room? He said, what a mess. I'm afraid to go in there. Can you believe it? You know who cares about keeping everything neat and tidy? Not me, that's who. Afraid to go in there. Some knight he is. The Amiibo Gizmo Gazebo. Wow. I don't have one. Nor do I have any Amiibos, so what's the point? Um, There's someone else here. How about this? What the heck? Do you know about the Cardinals? They are the ones who run the church. Their identities are a closely guarded secret. That's it. Let's finish the left side first before we move to the middle and then we go up. But first, how do we get there? Oh, I for some reason thought this was water. Ha! You can't even walk straight through those people. Why can't they even- Can I even jump? I should be able to jump! Oh. I didn't see that. What the? I know, right? That was a good technique of me just slipping in there. So. Who's here? Dorothea? Oh, Professor. Hello. I was just looking for my. Well, it's. It's like a pale blue cloth. Have you seen it? Oh, I think I know. Uh, that's not right. Uh, um, okay. I think I know who it is. Oh, Prick, I was just looking. Oh. What is it? I'm not doing anything. Cake? <laughs> it feels nice just to tease some people. Hmm, who's here? Shep, who are you? Have we met? No. What? Have we met? No. Sorry. You remind me of someone I know. She looks nice. Please. Um. I want to check on my. Hand. Uh, hello. Um, if you'll excuse me. Oh, Professor. Hello. Excuse me, I, um, I have to go. Match in writing. Okay, that was something. Did 
There's no one here. No. Local fish guide. Okay, so I just have to keep track of everything that's happening to me. No, I need to remember it just to keep it. An, an eye on these things. Hooked on fishing. So, greetings, Professor. Are you settled in here at the monastery yet? Like fish? You do know about the pond behind the dining hall, right? Hey! What? You look bored. Care to do? What? You there! We will accompany you on your assignment. Oh. We don't want anything to happen to our precious students. Nice. If any of you run into trouble, we'll step in and help out. Hello there. Hello. <laughs> General Kenobi. I see you're still flirting with some girls. Professor, you're the one taking out the bandits? <laughs> That's one way to start your career at the academy. I didn't expect they'd order us to risk our lives here. Seems a bit extreme, doesn't it? What's up, Professor? Hey, I got a girl waiting. Well, two. <laughs> they don't know about each other. I mean, can we talk later? Oh, there's three. Chan Reason. I was thinking, the Knights of Saros are also known as the Shining Knights. We are the sword and shield of the Divine Saros. There are many orders of knights in the world, but we are the only one that has the honor of bearing the name Saros. As a member of the church, you should probably study up on the history. On the hissy. Cyro. What the? That person sure does remind me of somebody. But oh, do you need me for something? Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Still, this would be like a good place to live, I guess. Seems like. To study. Do you know of the Iyer family? We have long held the position of prime minister in the empire. The Empire's power lies with six noble families, my family foremost among them. The full explanation may be time-consuming. I can give you a moment to get ready, if you would like to take notes. I'm ready. Alright, I will list the six great noble families. There's Kaspar's father, Count Burglies, the Minister of Military Affairs. Then there's Linhart's father, Count Hevering, the Minister of Domestic Affairs. Bernadetta's father, Count Varley, is the Minister of Religious Affairs. Hubert's father, Marquis Vestra, is the Minister of the Imperial Household. Finally, we have Duke Geert, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, and my own father, Duke Eyre, the Prime Minister. One day, I will take his place as the Prime Minister of the Empire. I am more talented than anyone in my class, even Edelgard. I will lead the Empire to a bright, enlightened future. There is nothing I cannot achieve. Good for you. The cathedral. Some people are just walking through the gate. Who is that? Hey you. Hey me. Right. Hi. Here's an idea. I hear the officers' academy of the monastery was founded about two centuries ago. The eastern region of Fodlan was being invaded by Almira, and so the Archbishop of the time took measures to prevent the border from being taken. In order to ensure Fodlan would be safe from potential threats, she deemed it necessary to raise a generation of excellence. That is how the establishment was founded, though its purpose has changed over the years. Nice. Um, how do I... Oh wait, I can fast travel by using a bulletin board. I have a favor to ask. Mercedes. Okay. <laughs> the cathedral is nice and quiet. It's so relaxing. Oh, Professor, did you come to pray to the goddess? That's alright. Me too. 
Shall we pray together? Oh, you want me to join your class? Hmm, well, I'm already having so much fun in my current class. So. Inside the cathedral, there is a chapel dedicated to the four saints. Do you know of them? Saint Indec, Saint Macuel, Saint Keyhole, and... Saint Sathleen! Who is your favorite professor? Now that you are a member of the church, be sure to familiarize yourself with our teachings and traditions. Sure, I guess. Inside the cathedral, there is Saint Indec... Saint... Now that you are... I have something to ask of you. Wait, who wants to talk to me? Oh, you! There is something else. It is the duty of every Fodlan noble to demonstrate piety towards Seros. Have you also come to offer your prayers to the goddess, Professor? You don't sound terribly sure. Perhaps you are not of noble birth? After all, devotion is not as essential for a common. It would seem that your reputation is on the rise. It's a shame I am not in- nor do I want you to in my class, because I don't know much about you. I guess let's just explore until we can do nothing else. Now I need to find a way to fast travel. Hmm. Mr. Owl! Door key, chest key. We should probably take one of these. Oh, where's the marketplace? Oh, wait. It's because I didn't go there, but so far. I guess this will be like my daily hour. Hourly, my my hourly episodes for this game at least. Uh, okay. Frigid, Almira, Dusker, even people from far off lands gather here at the academy. Word of advice, Professor. There are those who don't think kindly of such people. Professor? Oh, that re not really sure what it is. Hey there, Professor. Oh, not really sure. What? That's it? I thought there was gonna be something. Uh. My savior, thank you. I know she likes it. Who else likes it? Oh wait, no. These people like it the most, but these guys are just the uh, ones excited. Oh yeah, Manuel likes to sing. Okay, so I have one more thing. I'll keep my voice down. Don't want people thinking I'm vying for attention. But how loud is too loud? This is no good. Sing from your diaphragm. Lo! Get it? Lo! To gain faint, I gain authority. Nice. <laughs> Actually... Well done. You have my thanks. Now then. I have to go all the way to the library, so I need to go upstairs. Here's an idea. Here's an idea. Is there a way to fast travel to specific locations instead of just going to the? At least he goes straight to the quest. Let's see. Okay. What? 
Xanado, the Red Canyon, is a place of great significance to the Church of Seros. Even members of the Church are forbidden from entering without permission. To go trampling around in there, causing trouble. Mr. Foden. Before the founding. The War of Heroes. The first Mac War. So this is where the they just they they just uh, they just their alliance came in. Ah, Miran. Oh wait, there's something else. Lock it. I can't believe it. I'm so glad to be a student here. If only because I get to use this library, reading books from all the regions of Fodlan. I feel almost like I'm visiting those places myself. You can learn so much from books, but it's also good to visit them in person. I agree. They're brimming with the knowledge and experience of our ancestors. Ah, Professor. I'd like to learn more. Swimming through a sea of countless books, tracking down that single sought-after volume, it's absolute bliss. How do the poor fools who spend their days sharpening swords and polishing armor find any joy in life? What the? And that's it. Let's go. To the others. I think I'll end this episode with the uh, dining thing. Excellent work guiding the students in the mock battle. Taking command like that? Simply splendid. And bearing the unknown crest's power? Yes, I'm talking about you. Your talents are incredible, and Lady Rhea's insight as to your potential is doubly so. Oh, that's it. seem to have a mark of the exceptional about you. I only wish Seneth would follow your example. Where did he get a piece of my hair? Thanks for your help. So now it's easy. Inventory. Pretty easy. The battalion is something that I don't know. The battalion. <laughs> Otherwise, it's battalion. I see. Thank you for paying me a visit. Is there anything troubling you? Or is there perhaps something I can help you with? Believers live their lives by her sacred wisdom. Please use the library's vast resources to learn more. I can often be found here, so if there is ever anything you need, please do not hesitate to pay me a visit. Guess that's it. Let's go do the some do the chef. You're a lifesaver. What does she like? Sounds fun! Let me show you my cooking talent. <laughs> A little more secret spice and... Hey! No peeking! Oh nice! Right. 
Ah, oh, that sucks. I guess that's it. There's nothing else to do. There's nothing else on the map. So yeah, so I'm guessing the right side is the marketplace, so I should just go home. Well, it's Monday. Have you not been told what's expected from lectures here? Well, I can tell you how it works based on what I've heard from other professors. <laughs> she was teaching me everything when I'm supposed to be the teacher here. Again, it's good experience. Okay, if they like the answer. Skill goals. Before starting a lecture, it's a good idea to determine everyone's academic goals. Students will want to prioritize studying things that will help them achieve their aim. It's probably easier to get good results if you instruct students based on their interests and specialties. Of course, that doesn't mean it's pointless to teach someone things unrelated to their personal goals as well. By looking beyond their preferences, some students may find they're interested in fields they've never previously considered. True. Three star mark things. Let's go. Budding talent. A student's goals may change based on their studies or the experience they gain while on missions. When that happens, perhaps you could help them decide what new goals they should set for themselves. If I love to, if I have to hit someone, I want to do it from far away. Okay. How motivated a student is will affect how well your tutoring goes. To help cultivate their motivation, I think it's a good idea to interact with your students as much as possible. Please try your best to motivate everyone, so that they in turn will try hard with their assignments and activities. At the Officers Academy, students are encouraged to engage in various activities in and around the monastery. If you instruct your students to work together as a team, it will help to deepen their bonds and produce better results. I think Ferdinand's sleeping. You'll get gold and resources, okay. And it seems to increase their support. Have you heard about the support. certification exams? They take place every month. Everyone here is working hard to become a certain type of soldier. And those tests are how you can check to see how far we've come. In order to pass the exam, you need to train enough to become whatever class you're aiming for. Take care to develop your students strategically so that they can pass their certification exams. Okay, so this will at least let me know what finally they do. Okay. Follow instruct. Good test. Goals. Everyone seems to be super happy. Professor expertise. Strength. Weakness. A three star here. I still have much to learn. Oh, wow. I'm improving thanks to you. I'm improving, thanks to you. I guess it's better if I auto instruct, but I don't know what they want. And I, oh wait, I can only do it to two pe two people left. What does she want? Sword and reason. Everything went pretty well today. I don't know if I should invest for the three stars because it might be for them. Everything went. I appreciate. 
I appreciate your coach. Petra. I guess I should please level her up. I want to use her for the next episode if it, if she's able to. You have my thanks for your support. Perfect. I have understanding. You are giving me praise? I will get more soon. That's nice. Your guidance was greatly useful. Yes, that's it. I have nothing else. Stay with the erasers writing. She wants heavier. They can be like that. That's interesting. Oh wait, so I can only do it one, two, one. Okay. Yeah, I can only do one group task at a time. Let's do that then, let's go. May I ask? What's up? I'm an avid arms collector since coming to the field, however, I've had much more trouble finding you on this form of connection. That's so nice to show you some moments. I'm pretty sure those are pretty basic. Talking to a merchant. It depends on what kind of merchant blacksmith is teaching yourself how to create your own weapons. That is a good option. Nice. Reasoning. be working with each other <laughs> oh no this is impossible look professor we did great <laughs> oh no this is impossible look we did great <laughs> nice smith sm sm smiting stone smithing stone nice on the other day and Petra's like pretty normal. So that's a so that's basically a week. Whose birthday? Ravino. Sure. Thanks. Ah, <sighs> okay. Battle. Okay. Yeah, we need to buy some stuff before I'm gonna buy some stuff before I Well, that should be it for this episode. I hope you guys like this somewhat interesting episode. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Leave a like and subscribe. And, I'll, and I hope that you have a nice day.